Hi, George here. One of the features that has received an update here inside of Photoshop Elements 2023 is the slideshow, and several new themes have been added to that. Let's just see how the slideshow works and take a look at how we can change between those themes. I'll just grab a few of these pictures up here. Grab that one, I'll hold the control key down. We'll get a few more of these portraits in here. Just like that, that's good. And then over here under Create, you'll find the slideshow right there. Click on that. It's going to automatically load this in with a default slideshow. Real basic. And it has a basic soundtrack in there also. Nothing dramatic on that, just real standard slideshow effect. Now if you want to change this, let's put this on pause. Go up here, and we have three buttons. Top one is Media. This shows you the pictures that you have inside of your slideshow. You can add captions if you want to, if you have captions on your images, or you can actually type in captions if you want to right down here. You can add a text slide, so if you want to have a title slide or text slides between different segments of your slideshow, you can do that. And you can add more photos and videos right here. Then below that, we have audio at the very bottom. And in here, you can choose all of these different audio tracks and choose between those. Right now, we're looking at Paradise Resort, and it goes for 2 minutes and 4 seconds, although the slideshow is shorter than that. But the full length is 2 minutes and 4 seconds. You see the length over here, right-hand side. You can play to see how it sounds. Click the play button. And if you like it, click the plus button. It then adds that over here onto your selected tracks. Now the themes is the button here in the middle. There are quite a few in here, as you can see. If I scroll down, you can see here we have the, the older themes down there and then some newer themes up towards the top. And to change a the theme, all you have to do is just click on the theme, click apply. It's then going to redo the slideshow using that new applied theme. And it then automatically begins playing. So you can see how it looks. And here we go, here's this new theme. Slice of life is doing little slices. Kind of fun like that. Okay, put it on pause again. We'll do one more of these themes. Let's just come down here and we'll take a look at this tint, shuffle, and slide. Click your theme, hit apply. It applies that new theme and then plays your slideshow with the new theme. And here we go. Rather nice. I think I like that. And there it is. Okay. My only real complaint with the Photoshop Elements slideshow is that you don't have any options. I can't change which transitions are being used. I can't change how long a slide is on the screen. I can't do a lot of those things I would like to do. I'd like to have that freedom to adjust this. But for a quick slideshow with one of these themes over here, it does a very good job. If you're happy with it and you want to keep it, do a save or save as. You also can export the slideshow out here to YouTube, Vimeo, or onto your hard drive up to the cloud or to Facebook to have those save options. I'm not going to bother with that. I'm just going to back out of this right here, and I'm not going to save it to the organizer. And if you like this video, click that like button, click on share, click on subscribe, take a look at my channel for a bunch more Photoshop Elements videos, and check out my complete training course for Photoshop Elements. There's a link for that right down there in the description. And I'll see you next time.